the, uh, the uh, visual arts and you combine that with uh, music and performing art, you actually get a much deeper comprehension of what Inuit culture is like. This is Tusarnatut. This is music born of the cold. Uh, Tusarnatut means sounds pleasing to the ear. This Indigenous History Month, the Royal Ontario Museum is inviting us to experience something unique. A new exhibit that takes a close look at Inuit musical expression. And while music is at the center of the theme, visitors can expect to come face to face with 100 sculptures, prints, drawings, and installations from the 1950s to present day, specifically paired to create a complete experience between what you hear and what you see. You really put the music and the art in context, in conversation, right? Which sounds like, oh yeah, well, I kind of knew that, but oftentimes you don't, right? Because you see them independently. You may hear the throat singing, but you don't see the sculpture, you don't see the video. You may see the sculpture, but you actually don't hear it at the same time as the throat singing. The geographic area, which is quite extensive, that the exhibition deals with, right? And so there are objects within this particular exhibition that you know, touch upon each of these areas. This uh, narwhal uh, tusk, as you go from the bottom to the top and follow this carving up, you'll see all sorts of uh, sort of uh, images, if you will, of Inuit life, uh, song, dance. So this, uh, this loon headdress uh, is in the collection. It's part of the collection of the Royal Ontario uh, Museum. It really uh, uh, reveals how much and how deeply the culture is connected to uh, other uh, natural life forms within the Inuit environment. So at the entrance experience, you hear a song that's being played, and uh, that is kind of the first connection you have to the music right when you enter the exhibition. And then when you come inside, there are also headsets that you can listen to and watch videos and absorb the music that way. And then the third way is through this uh, theater room that we created. And we allowed that sound to spill into the gallery. At the same time, the museum itself says the exhibit is part of its commitment to Indigenous Canada. It's being presented in partnership with the Montreal Museum of Fine Arts. What this is about is, I think, really exploring the roots of Inuit music, in this case being shamanism, um, drumming, throat singing, but also looking at how those traditions change over time and continue to change, as well as look at a lot of these contemporary influences, how Inuit music and music from the North in general is really changing Canadian music and changing uh, the music world in general. If you can't make it this month, there's still lots of time with the full presentation available until September. At the Royal Ontario Museum, David Zura, City News.